What's good? It's your boy, His Will, and I'm back with another reaction video. So, today we are going to be going over the, we're going to be reviewing um, Dietrich Haddon. And this song is called One Night in California. It's off his new album. Now, let me tell you something about Dietrich Haddon. He's what got me into gospel music and doing gospel music um when i met my wife at the time we were dating she played i remember she played the album with the seven days and then i was listening to that and i couldn't put it down and that's what brought me into more and more and more gospel because now being r&b head and hip-hop and all that now i've come into where i do rng rhythm and gospel and I can still have the same beautiful time singing and doing that, but it's singing to the Lord and also putting out a positive message. So instead of people want to go home with something to poke on, they want to go home with something to pray on. And so that's the type of music with a message that I want to present. And so this was from his new album. So uh, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Um, this is the f one of the first of my other series, uh, my reactions, because I'm doing different um, genres. So you'll see them on a different playlist. So whatever you guys want to listen to, you know, that's for y'all. So everything would be separate up up there and stuff. So y'all rock with what you want to rock with. So make sure you guys like, comment down below, subscribe, all that good stuff. Share, hit the notification bell. Make sure if there's other songs you want to hear from the gospel world, Put them down in the comments from anybody. Let's get into it. All genres, let's go of his gospel and everything. That's what this is specifically for. This playlist is for the gospel. So under here, we're going to do strictly gospel. Let's get it. If y'all have artists you want me to review and look at different songs, let's get it. All right. So let's go ahead and um, hopefully this goes right here. Everything is acting kind of slow. You know how that goes. Uh. So let's see. Here we go. Never forget the day talking to my lady. He said, Dietrich, I am pregnant. We're having a baby. You should have seen the smile on my face. Sudden, my joy went away. You see, the divorce wasn't final, and I knew it would go viral. And I went against the Bible. I needed a revival. I started running. I didn't know what to do. On road day, oh, I ran into you. I keep on.
Yeah, that's C, and that right there is what got me into the golf right there from this man. Uh, man, I'm trying to tell you, it was this vibe right here. Mm, mm, mm. And how many people have that story? You know, we all struggle with something. We all fall short of the glory of God seeing each day we have to you know die daily because it's especially as men and then as we know you know men coming up now it's summertime and all that good stuff so you know what uh, you know what it's about to be you know it's about to go down and that's and that is the uh, sundress season so you know how that goes and you know it's just a lot you know, in the summertime, the clothes are less and stuff we deal with on daily men are visual. And so, it, you know, and shirts are going to be off and all these type of different things. So for both men and women, but the transparency, the transparent, the transparency. Yeah, transparency that Dietrich Haddon has in the music. That's what I like to bring to my own music. Rhythm and gospel. We all have struggles. I write about different stuff that I've been through others have been through and maybe some scenarios that I thought of but it's all transparency and trying to just be real and this song was off the chain man I love the harmonies I love everything the lyrics was good I mean he told you poured his heart out to you you know just because you're in the clergy doesn't mean you're perfect we all still have those struggles drinking weed women things of that nature I remember that time when he was going through all that with his um with his ex um, I met her, as a matter of fact, when I was at Hampton, she came, Demita. Um, Demita, and she's a gospel artist as well, and she signed. I have, as a matter of fact, Demita Joe. Yeah. Yep, Demita Joe, right over there next to, right where I'm pointing, that's her poster right there. Um, that she signed it when I was in college. So, But I remember that time he was going through the stuff and, and they was all in the, he was all up in the news and people was talking about him and doing all this type of stuff. But, you know, here it is. But anyway, song was off the chain. Um, got me rolling. Look, I don't want to be in too long for y'all. I know y'all don't want me to be doing that, but it's just this artist right here is what brought me to it. So it's just so much stuff to talk about. So make sure y'all like, comment down below, subscribe. Let me know what you want to hear um, in the gospel realm. Um, and like I always say, if you do, I always say peace and mohair grease. You dig? Ooh and I'm out like a sprout, no doubt.